place. Like I'm an Aries, so I'm like, I don't, I, I go against the grain. I don't, I don't want to work. I don't want my kids in this system. I understand that nobody's going to save me, that I have to save my babies, right? Um, and I just want, like, what is it that I can do? And I'm in, I'm in Minneapolis and there's not a big culture here. There's not a lot like how you guys were saying in New York and stuff like that. We don't really have that here. So it's just me and my babies, right? And like I said, I know that I have to save us. Nobody's gonna come and save us. And I'm just like, what can I do? I don't want them homeschooled. They didn't get shots, I'm, but I don't wanna work, but I have to in order to survive. And it's just like, you know what I mean? Well, sis, you got this. Let me say that first. Yeah. And foremost, and just like I was speaking to the brother a few minutes ago, self-preservation is going to be the first law of nature here. So don't overthink it. We got to take care of babies first. So mommy has to go out and, and make a way because nobody else is going to make a way. Or mommy can sit there and hope the spirit is going to provide. And we know that the universe don't work like that. When we move forward and activate the certain energy, the universe is conspiring to help us, but we have to move forward. This is some form of test, uh, you know, for you to understand what you're being challenged with because we're all being challenged with different things. I hated sending my kids uh, to, to certain schools and this and that, but I watch parents do it all the time because at the moment they have no choice. At the moment they have no choice. You know what I mean? So I'm never down on parents who send their kids to public school or this and that, because especially the parents who know better, but in order to, you know, we have to know better, we got to do better, but that requires time and energy. So you got this, your babies are going to be the ones that are going to help you get through this. And I would get on my grind. If someone is offering me some work, calm yourself to find out how you're going to Work this out with the babies. But when you take two steps forward, the universe is also going to take two steps forward. And what you think is a problem now is going to be a footnote in the, uh, you know, the journey that comes along that was tailor made for you to have to deal with. Yes. And I just wanted to add this, that like when I was thinking of my question before I got on, I, I realized because I, like I said, I haven't been working, but I'm getting my CDL right now. And that's mm. the, I'll be making $26 an hour um, and I can bring my oldest noble with me. But um, Spirit spoke and said, the, the, the doors are opening. You just have to, you know, as I was sitting and I was like, yes, and, and this is just the start. You know what I mean? Even though it's something that I don't want to, but I got to do what I got to do to get to where I need to get to. And yes. I businesses right now. So this will be able for me to fund those businesses and stuff like that. You know, so. No, I'm with you, sis. And we got you. Yeah. You know what I mean? And mama going to make a way. And mama always going to make a way. You better believe it. Yes. Yeah, yeah I'll, I'll, just to add on, because you're our last caller, sis, I appreciate you calling. And uh, just by the way, they are asking if you have a cash app in the chat. Do you have one, sis? They're asking I don't it. have a cash app, but I have a Venmo, and my name is Jasmine Green, J-A-S. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. I'm hold not on. that fast. Give me a oh, second. You said, you said Venmo, right? Yeah, my Venmo. Yeah. Venmo. All right, what's your name? I'm not I'm not familiar with Venmo. What's your, what's your it, name? It's Jasmine, J-A-S-M-I-N-E. Huh? M-I-N-E, uh-huh. G-R-E-E-N-E, -E -E -E, like the color green. Yeah. Nine, three. So Jasmine Green, nine, three. Yes, and there's a picture of me and my son, Noble, in the picture, yeah. Okay. Ja let me just spell this so I won't get it wrong. J A S M I N E G G R E E N E nine three. Yes. All right. Well, uh, yeah. I just posted the the Queen's Venmo for anybody who would like to uh, support uh, the Queen. And I just want to add, Queen, uh, before you get out of here, um, that you have to keep in mind uh, this is a metaphysical channel that you're listening to. I, I, wa I watch you all the time. Indeed. And one of the things we stress, and we're not, I don't ever want people to think that we're up here lying about this. There's literally 75 trillion cells in you that yeah. you could talk to and that are waiting to guide you and that are waiting to instruct you <laughs> and are waiting for commands from you. They're waiting yes. for you to tell it what to do. 75 trillion. 
sentient beings are waiting for you to tell them what to do. So yeah. you, I want you to keep in mind how powerful you are. And I would advise you, don't spend less than one hour a day in meditation. If you're serious about what you're saying, you see, I would say no less than an hour. Yeah. You tap in, wait till the baby's asleep, tap in. The, they will give you an answer that me, dot Dr. Valentine, nobody could give you the answer as great as those 75 trillion cells they're going to give you if you just tune into them, tell them what you want, and they'll guide you into where you got to go. Yes, and, and I do. Like, I have my meditation area. I have my altar. Like, yeah. I'm a Reiki practitioner. Like, Beautiful. you know, but I fall short sometimes. And like I said, I hadn't worked for over a year and a half, and now I'm like, I got to get back to it, you know? Yeah. But I, I listen, and I hear spirit. They've, sh they've told me they want to show themselves to me, and I'll be like, okay, come on. Let's you go. Know? Yep. And I'm a warrior. I come from warriors. I can tell. Know, uh, yeah. Indeed. I appreciate the call, sis. Yes. Thank you, guys. All right, appreciate all right, peace, 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 peace. Indeed. Yeah, Dad. I definitely. I want us to know how powerful we really are. Like, yes. we're not. We're not lying about this shit, Dad. I'm not no, up here I'm, just to get some views. I'm dead serious about I'm, this shit, Dad. I'm a walking, talking <laughs> example of it every like, single day. Like, bro, this is uh, this is one of my favorite books. I always tell people, um, it's got a um raggedy. Becoming supernatural. Yes, I, I go through this. Kind of